In today's class, we will be learning the topic, Jesus as the Lamb of God. When John the Baptist sees Jesus coming towards him he says that Jesus is the Lamb of God who takes away the sin of the world. He refers to Jesus as the one that comes after him but who comes with more authority than him. He, apart from presenting Jesus as a gentle, humble, and harmless person like a lamb, also points to him as the sacrificial lamb for the sin of the world. The ewe lamb is animal which is often sacrificed for a sin offering, to atone for the sin of the people. It is regarded as a clean animal recognizing the authority of its owner. Hence John the Baptist is predicting that Jesus will die to atone for their sins. Jesus as the door and the good shepherd. Jesus referred to himself as the door and the good shepherd, truly, truly, I say to you, he who does not enter the sheepfold by the door but climbs in by another way, that man is a thief and a robber, but he who enters by the door is the shepherd of the sheep. Jesus explained that a shepherd should be sympathetic with his flock, brave to protect them from dangers and be resourceful enough to provide for their needs, and also be a good leader for the sheep. He must be observant to identify them individually. The true shepherd enters or leaves through the door but a thief will enter or leave through other means to avoid being seen and apprehended. The true shepherd will also be familiar with the sheep and be recognized by them. They are expected to run away from the thief who appears as a shepherd, the false shepherd. This means that the people chosen by God can be reached by him through Jesus Christ while God also can be reached only through Jesus because he is the intermediary between God and man. Hence those who attempt to obtain salvation except through Jesus are thieves and robbers. Jesus is all sufficient for salvation. Thanks for watching. See you in the next video.